Enforcement in Florida is reeling after learning one of their own was at the Parkland shooting last week and could have stepped in to help stop the bloodshed. Instead, he stood outside while shots were being fired. The president is now leading the charge, calling for more adults inside schools to be armed. The Broward County Sheriff says it made him sick to his stomach to see a new surveillance video that shows an armed officer who was at the Parkland, Florida High School last week during the shooting stand by and do nothing. What I saw was a deputy arrive at the west side of Building 12, take up a position, and he never went in. That deputy, Scott Peterson, resigned yesterday after being suspended without pay. This revelation comes on the second day in a row President Trump called for teachers and other school personnel to be armed. He said they should even get paid extra to carry a gun. Nobody's going to attack that school, believe me, because they're cowards. They don't want to be shot at. That stance was echoed by the head of the NRA at this week's Conservative Political Action Conference. Our NFL games, our office buildings, our movie stars, our politicians, they're all more protected than our children at school. Does that make any sense? President Trump, who will speak today at the same CPAC event, broke slightly with the NRA yesterday, tweeting in part, I will be strongly pushing comprehensive background checks with an emphasis on mental health, raise age to 21, and end sale of bump stocks.